Once upon a time, there was a lost planet called Kilokali, a place like no other in the universe. It was a land of great beauty, with towering mountains, rolling hills, and endless forests. But it was also a place of great danger, where fierce warriors roamed the land and protected it from those who would do it harm. I am an old woman, and I have lived on Kilokali for many years. I have seen the rise and fall of many great civilizations, and I have watched as the warriors of Kilokali have defended our planet time and time again. They are fierce and fearless, and they will stop at nothing to protect what they hold dear. The warriors of Kilokali are born with a special gift, a connection to the elemental forces of our planet. They can control the elements, harnessing the power of fire, water, earth, and air to defeat their enemies. Their strength and skill are unmatched, and they are feared by all who seek to do us harm. One of the most famous warriors of Kilokali was a woman named Cassandra. She was a fierce warrior with a fire in her heart that could not be quenched. She led her people to victory time and time again, and her name is still remembered with great reverence to this day. But the warriors of Kilokali were not just protectors of our planet. They were also wise, just leaders who ruled with fairness and compassion. They were the guardians of our ancient knowledge and they passed down their wisdom from generation to generation. And so, Kilokali remained a place of peace and prosperity for many years as the warriors continued to defend us from those who do us harm. But one day, a great darkness descended upon our planet an evil force threatened to destroy all that we had built, and it was seemed as though all was lost. But the warriors of Kilokali did not give up. They stood firm and fought with all their might, and in the end, they emerged victorious. The evil was defeated, and Kilokali was once again a place of peace and prosperity. And so, the warriors of Kilokali live on, their legacy remembered through the ages. They may be gone, but their spirit and their bravery will never be forgotten. They are the fierce protectors of Kilokali, and their story will always be told. Join me for another tale next time.